Hello race fans, the Mountain Dew Code Red Trucks here are back. This is Tits, aka Bristol, the world's fastest half mile. And we're here for the Tits 200. Tits. <laughs> anyway, anyway, starting on the pole here is our season one champion, Jack Richards. He hasn't really had um He hasn't really had the best of seasons, but he he's gonna have to uh uh try to uh try to show what he He's made of starting a second right beside him is the guy who um who completely sucks at short tracks, Aaron Williams. But this is his chance to uh to get a to get a good run in trucks today, as we're about to have those famous words in motorsports. Gentlemen, start your Get our rhythm. Get ready to rock and roll today. It's a long race. There will be a lot of pit stops. So just go out there, do what you gotta do. No mistakes. That's the big thing today. Just no mistakes. You know, man, we already got a truck blowing up. Here's our starting lineup for the Tits 200. And it's been confirmed that the truck that was blowing up was Evan Earnhardt in the 60 song. So I don't know what's going to happen to the 60 truck. He may not get to start as the, uh, uh, as the green flag here is out at tits. Jack Richards not, not wasting, uh, any time. He, he's already trying to run away with the lead. Aaron Wills, he's hanging out, uh, um, in second place. Now Aaron Wills, he also, uh, Came in second in the Sega in the Sega race here. You know, man, we just had uh, a battle for third between Joshua Collar and Alex Drayton, and we just lost some three wide back here. You know, oh man, four wide. Don't do that, guys. Oh, and there goes and there goes Travis Mitchell. He got taken out by Danny Wells, and the caution is out. He just got hit by Dylan Young in the Blue Deuce. Oh wait, no caution! Oh, oh wait a minute, no caution! He's still on the track! What the hell? Kurt Morrison scraping the wall there in the 18. Whoa! Whoa, oh man, shockingly enough, that did not bring out the caution. And Chris Kyle, he's on pit road. Wow, that did not bring out the caution. Let me check something real quick. Yeah, 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 yellow flags are on, so. Wow, wow, shockingly enough, that did not bring out our first caution. And Jack Richards, he continues to dominate here at Bristol. Now, Alex Drayton, he's, uh, he's in third. He's going to try to uh, make a move on, on the 48. Let's check on Danny Will. You know, and oh man, Dylan Ponte, now now he's coming down pit road. Let's check on D Danny Wills because he's the one that took out that took out um Travis Mitchell. Danny Wills, he, he's running uh in the fifteenth position right now. He he he's still uh running good so far. There's Trent Dillon and Matt Wheeler gonna try to work on uh Trying to work on passing uh Lyndon Wright in that 23 truck. Okay, race so far. And Travis Mitchell, he uh he's now 
back on the track. And oh man, he almost uh he almost took out uh Aaron Williams. That was close. Travis Mitchell, he shot in 36th position, six laps down. And it turns out, it turns out that Evan Earnhardt had a broken pistol. And oh man, uh uh Chris Kyle, he he's five laps down, and Dylan Posey, he's four laps down. See, see, uh these um these pit rows are so short, it's easy to get lapped. Um, um, at a place like this, but green flag piss offs are, are going to come into question as Jack Richards he continues to dominate here. Aaron Williams, uh, hanging on a second, he's trying to wait, wait for the right opportunity here. There's Michael Norman in the uh, in the fourth position in the 27 truck, he just got around the 17th of Alex Drayton. Six now is Sean Henley, seventh is James Qualls, eighth place is Stevie Pye in the 43. Right behind him is his good buddy Joseph Lombard in the 09 truck, and 10th is Robert Brooks. Robert Brooks, he's been running pretty, pretty consistent um, in that Red Horse Racing number 7. Let's ride on board with him. You can now see Robert Brooks trying to work out passing Joseph Lombard. You see uh, James Falls, he just went up. Uh, Way high out of turns one and two, but I think he managed to get his truck back in the right place. Heading back, uh, heading back to the to the front. Jack Richards, uh, his league continues to grow. I, um, I'll tell you, he's very lucky that that caution didn't come out for the. For the number 30. Just like him through the field. There's his teammate, uh, Jasmine Acosta. She's shown in 33rd, and she's got a lot of damage. I think that came on pit road when all the trucks bust up behind the smoking Evan, Evan Earnhardt. There's last week's winner, Tim Faka, trying to work trying to work on passing Arnold Columbia, who's actually the points leader right now, but, but he's not really uh running so well back here. There's Barney Ward in the nine truck. He's gonna try to uh get a good run today. And Chris Kyle actually uh he's second in the points, but now he's 34th uh five laps down. And Dylan Punty he uh he dropped out of the race. So, so oh man I don't know what happened to the three. There's Seth Colt in the 24 getting behind William Duncan. Now we see uh. Cody Lamas in the 22 truck trying to work on passing James McLeod with the help of Zach Carlson. They're running, uh, they're running up pretty close side by side. There's, uh, uh, there's Anthony, uh, McCreary in the 98 with a, uh, who had, uh, a very impressive, uh, third, third place finish last week at Michigan. And oh man, he's scraping the wall. He needs to get off that wall. And oh, and oh man, just look at that damage to that 98 truck he got to his to uh, his right rear. That made him, that made him lose a lot of momentum. Right now he's running in the 18th position. As we head back to the front, and oh man, we almost had some three wide racing between between uh, Joshua Collar and Sean Henley. This is the battle for the fifth position. As we're uh. As we're passing the halfway mark right now, Al Drayton continues to hang to hang up uh, back in uh fourth. And Anthony McCreary he came down pit road to fix that damage to his 98. And oh boy, and oh boy, we're just having a uh, battle for second. Michael Norman and Aaron Williams. Michael Norman's trying to take it away from the 48, and Aaron Williams he's trying to fight as hard as he can on that outside line. But Michael Norman, uh, Michael Norman, he's trying to clear Aaron Williams. Can't quite, uh, can't quite do it, but uh, he just did. Now Aaron Williams, he's gonna try to bounce back to get to get his second position back. But the more they go side by side, uh, the more uh, Jack Richards is is gonna get away. Now Jack, Jack Richards' lead, and whoa, man, he just got hella loose, and oh. And oh man, Kasha's out. The Kasha's out for the first time today. 
South Africa with Dylan Young and, and uh, Zach Carlson. Kaja comes out for the first time today. And oh man, Brian Pasternak, he's got some damage. And oh man, that is not what Jack Rich wanted to see at all. That two second lead he had just went out the window as something happened to Dylan Young and and uh, Zach Carlson. So we're gonna have to take a look and see what happened here as Jack Richards is our leader. He's already clinched most laps led. Now here's what happened to Travis Mitchell that did not bring out the caution earlier. This was lap number two. He gets hooked by Danny Wells in the five and then he get and then he just gets into the safer barrier and then he just spins out in front of the field. Then he got slammed by by a Jasmine Casa and Barney Ward. That's where she, she got that damage. Chris Dalton uh went low to uh avoid him. Then then Travis he got hit by by a uh, Dylan Young. Then that's where he got uh stuck on the track. Shock shockingly enough, that did not bring out our caution, but this did. Now this is what brought out our first caution. Zach Carlson tried to uh try uh try to go to the inside um of Coy Lamas, but Coy Lamas just blocked him. That sends Zach Carlson into the safer barrier. Then he spins out right in front of Brian Pasternak. Brian Pasternak and Levin had uh had nowhere to go. Then Zach Carlson he gets slammed by the by a uh, the blue deuce. So both of the both of the Penske trucks uh were um involved with uh with Zach Carlson's accident. And here we are back at tits and pit stops have greatly have greatly shoveled up the field. Our new leader is Michael Norman. Both Aaron Williams and Jack Richards had had bad stops, and they are both one lap down. There they go on the inside row. Aaron Williams is shown now in 26th position, and Jack Richards, who dominated this race, is now shown in 30th at the lap down. Michael Norman is our new leader, then followed by Alex Drayton, Joshua Collard, Sean Henley, Stevie Pye, Joseph Lombard, Robert Brooks, Cole Daly, William Duncan, and James McLeod. That is our top 10, as we are having the restart. And Michael Norman, oh man, he got a uh, he got a rocket start. Michael Norman, he already uh he already uh has a victory here at Bristol. It came in the Arca series. So So oh man, Michael Norman, he's trying to go two for two um at Bristol. He's got a lap truck between him and the guy who's in a uh, second place right now. Second place now is um is Alex Drayton out of Red Horse Racing, Preston Plot, uh Chris implored, he's 26 a lap down. And oh man, Anthony McCrory, he's um um he's um I think he's three laps down. Let's see. No, 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 he's four laps down. But oh man, Michael Norman, he has a um, he has a pretty huge lead um over Alex Drayton. He has he has uh four lap trucks separating him from um from second. And oh man. Oh, oh man, Chris Kyle just got hella loose. There's a truck who's in third, Joseph Lombard. Joshua Collard is, um, Joshua Collard's fourth. And the caution's back out. The caution is back out for the second time tonight. Trying to see what happened. And oh man, I think it was, I think it was Sean Henley because he's got some major rear damage to the back of his eight truck. And oh man, he just got tapped by uh by uh Andre Lance in the 32. And Seth Cole's got damage. Oh man. I think something happened uh something happened in the back straight away. And Barney Ward, he's on the apron, he's coming down pit road. So we have to check and see what happened here as uh as Michael Norman, he's our leader.
Here's how to brought out our second caution. Now, two accidents actually happened here. This is our first one. At a turn three, Steven Gonzalez just came down onto Sean Henley, and then both of them just get into James Qualls, and Sean Henley, he spins out in front of the field. Now, I don't know what Steven was thinking, but he should have gave Sean some more room because that was uncalled for. Sean, he spins out in the middle of the turn. He gets hit by William Duncan, and then he gets hit by Barney Ward. That was the first accident. Now here's the second accident coming up at a turn number two. They went three wide, then Matt Wheeler, he comes up right right into Seth Cole, hooks him up on his left rear quarter panel, then he just takes him out. Seth Cole went head first into into the safer barrier and he nearly get he nearly gets slammed by Lyndon Wright but Lyndon Wright he was just lucky enough to miss it. Now Seth Cole at the time he was running in the top fifteen so that's a real tough break for Seth right there in that number twenty four truck. And here we are back at Bristol, uh, getting ready to restart with, uh, nine laps to go. Michael Norman is still the leader. And, and three trucks away is Alex Drayton, who's second. Third, uh, third is Joseph Lombard. Fourth is Josh, uh, fourth is Joshua Collard. Fifth is James McLeod. Sixth is Kurt Mornsnick. Seventh is Cole Daly. Eighth is last week's winner, Tim Feigl. Ninth is Callum Wells. And tenth is Tony Blazer. Andre needs to figure out some way to get to Michael Norman as we as we are having the restart. Michael Norman has proven that that he can uh uh drive at Bristol after winning here in the Arca series. He's gonna try to go he's gonna try to go two for two here. As you now see the the lab trucks uh trying to uh work together. Preston Plore uh trying to battle. Battle it out with Anthony McCrory. Real good, uh, real good view of the track with the spectators' camera. As you now see, Michael Norman, uh, going in the uh, turns three and four here to come to six laps to go. None of the uh none of the trucks uh took pit stops uh on the last uh caution so pit stops they can still still be a factor for this race but Michael Norman he, he needs to hope that he has enough fuel and Williams he uh he's really really uh trying to battle it out with Michael Norman to get his uh his lap back after being in second place all day a bad pit stop just took it all the way now Aaron Williams he's shown in the 23rd position. As we now have, uh, as, as we now have, uh, four laps to go now. Michael Norman, he, uh, he is dominating. He has a second and a half, uh, lead over Alex Drayton. If the caution comes back out, then this race is over. Michael Norman just needs to hang off for three more laps. If he can do it, then he'll, uh, then, then he'll finally capture his, uh, his first truck, truck series. Victory. He dominated Daytona at the beginning of the season, but fell short to Steven Gonzalez. But I think tonight is going to be his night. Still trying to battle out with with uh Aaron Williams. It seems like that Aaron Williams is pushing the is pushing uh that 27 truck. As we're coming to the white flag, Michael Norman is taking the white flag, and I don't think he has to pit anytime soon. No, he does not. Coming out of turn number four to win here at Tits. It's Michael Norman. Michael Norman wins the Tits 200 here at Bristol Motor Speedway. Second place is Alex Drayton, who really didn't have a shot, but, but still, second place is good. Joseph Lombard ends up third. Joshua Collard fourth. James McLeod is fifth. Callum Wells sixth. Seventh is Tim Figo. That's gonna do good for his points lead. Eighth place is Danny Wells. Crap, I lost him. 
There he is. Ninth place is um, Kurt Morsink. And running out the top ten is Chris Dalton, who I think pitted already. Tits 200. And the standings and the standings are now are now official. Michael Norman captures his second ever his uh uh his second ever uh Bristol victory and his first truck series win here. I've already announced the top ten. Tony Blazer ends up eleventh, Lyndon Wright twelfth, Cody Lamas thirteenth, Matt Willer fourteenth, running out the top fifteen is Cole Daly. Then it's Robert Brooks, William Duncan, Stephen Gonzalez, Seth Cole, and Sean Henley running out the top twenty. Then it's Trent Dunham. Then Jasmine Lacasa was the last truck on the lead lap. Aaron Williams was 23rd. Preston Plore 24th. Zach Carlson 25th. James Claus 26th. Jack Richards 27th. Who who dominate who who led the first half of this entire race and he ends up 27th a lap down. Andre Lance is 28th. Arnold Columbia is 29th, two laps down. Anthony McCrory was 30th, four laps down. 31st was Chris Kyle, five laps down, and Travis Mitchell, who uh who spun out at the at the very beginning of the race, is 32nd, six laps down. And trucks that retired out: Barney Ward, Brian Pasternak, Dylan Young, Dylan Pote, and Evan Earnhardt, who didn't even get a chance to run here. That's our field. Well, the trucks are out of here. We will see you next time for the next Truck Series race. Congratulations one last time to Michael Norman for winning here at TITS.